going on everybody? My name is Baloo and welcome to The Jungle. This is the channel where we take a very simple approach to technical analysis. We look at the price in the context of volume using the Wyckoff method. If that is something that interests you, then why don't you hit the subscribe button? I do this every single day, except for the days that I don't. So in today's video, I wanna take a look at, what am I looking at? I'm, look, I'm gonna go ahead and take a look at the entire DeFi space. I wanna kind of run through the DeFi uh, uh, index. And then I also wanna take a look at a coin request called Helium. So let's go ahead and just quickly take a look at, uh, you know what, let's take a look at Helium. So Helium HNT, I know nothing about this project as per usual, ranked 140 on uh, coin market cap, $85 million market cap and $1 million worth of trading volume. Not the best trading volume for this asset, that is for sure, but you know, we have a nice uptrend it looks like. So let's just, uh, is it on Binance? We have it on Binance. Let's go ahead and take a look at HNT USD. HNT USD. T. All right. Okay, so it's pretty flat, actually. It's pretty flat. Uh, when you're seeing something flat, it's it's really simple. Don't uh, don't make these trading ranges complicated. You could apply a Wyckoff accumulation box to it, but the whole point of those boxes is to find out where to buy, and uh, you know, it, this is where you buy. Level to break right here. Breakout. If you can break this, uh, then you'd be beginning to change the character. This is, this would be the first, uh, this would be the beginning of a change of behavior, a possible change of direction, a trend change. So you're going to scale in. You need to go uh, spot market or low leverage or whatever. You need to start to scale in. You don't go all in on all this stuff. Like if, you know, if we're talking about trades, which is what this channel is focusing on, you wanna buy something that is trending in the right direction. Right now we have a low, we have a high, we have a higher low, and that's it. We don't, we have not confirmed a higher high. So until we can get a higher high, you don't really want to trade it. Now, uh, I'm not talking about fundamentals. I know nothing about what this project does, but from a trading point of view, not something that I am looking to get into. So that's that. Let's go ahead and take a look at the DeFi section, sector. DeFi per. DeFi is doing really well, that's good. I should probably take a look at uh, some of my more speculative DeFi plays. So, do have this downsloping accumulation, um, but we're gonna simplify this a little bit more and just see how it responded to the buyer's climax. We have a backup that is occurring on the buyer's climax. So, this could consolidate for a little bit longer. We have a beautiful, but like look at the sell, uh, sorry, not sell pressure, the buy pressure. Look at these wicks on the daily here on the DeFi perp. This level is being protected. This level is definitely being de defended by the buyers. We had a couple shakeouts, but this, this is looking good. So if we can see some breaks above this level right here, level to break, level to break right there. If we can get a break above that, we're gonna be looking really good. And I think that given this accumulation, this is a beautiful accumulation, by the way, look at the price structure, see how tight and consolidated these candles are. Very low volume, boom, touch the bottom of the range, spring to the top of the range, consolidated for the backup for this uh, sloped consolidation. Now we are starting to leave into mark uh, phase D. This is the beginning stages of markup. Markup is where all the action happens. When you get into an asset early on in markup, those are the coins that make you happy. So uh, DeFi section, uh, DeFi sector, why do I keep calling it section? <laughs> the DeFi sector is looking really, really good. So if I am not mistaken, please, uh, anybody in the comments section, uh, go ahead and correct me if I'm wrong, but this uh, perpetual futures contract found on FTX is uh, an index based on the top uh, 20, top, you know what, I, I don't know. What, uh, if anybody knows what the uh, index is composed of, it's either top 20, top 50, or top 100, whatever it, whatever it may be, but either which way, it is a um, index based on the performance of the top DeFi uh, coins. 
So DeFi is looking really strong right now. I'm liking where this is heading, and I think we're gonna see some pretty incredible moves inside of the DeFi sector, as long as these levels here hold. So I'm keeping it really simple in this video, guys. If you are interested in learning uh, how to simplify your technical analysis and, and uh, up your trading uh, ability, uh, strategy is really, really important. You know, technical analysis, it is the backbone. We need to learn technical analysis and we need to know what it is that we are looking at. But that information that you are gaining from technical analysis is not telling you a direction. It's telling you a probability of direction and giving you information to enter a trade. Now, strategy is really what makes a good trader versus a bad trader. So if you are interested in learning some of the strategies that I employ on a daily basis to help my uh, trading uh, account, then I encourage you to join the Discord down below. We can get you up to speed. And if you would like to see some of the projects that I am investing in and some of the profitable trading setups that I am taking, then I encourage you to join the VIP. It's only $14.99 a month. And uh, I think that I offer a lot of value. So uh, that's all the time I have for today. If you enjoyed the content, please leave it a like. Don't forget to subscribe. And if there are any projects you would like me to take a look at, leave them in the comment section down below. And until next time, please trade safe. It is a jungle out there. Peace.